Hey, what's up, Granos and Granettes? Juan Granos, back again, this time with another review slash tutorial. So, um, I know some of you have gone through this before, and I know I just did a couple of weeks ago while I was editing one of my shows. I deleted one of my um, files by mistake. Not only did I delete it, but I also hit empty trash. So the file was gone, you know, it was, you know, disappeared. So um, the next tutorial review, it might help you out. It helped me out and I'm gonna show you how it works. Um, the name of the company is called Wondershare Recovery Software. Um, and basically all it does is you install a little piece of software in your machine and if you by mistake, uh, you know, accidentally delete one of your files where there's photos videos even emails PDFs I mean you name it um, you could recover it with this software so I'm gonna show you guys how that works um, I already installed the software in my machine um, I'm just gonna show you I'm gonna do a you know a, a hypothetical I'm gonna delete some software from my machine I'm gonna hit empty trash and I'm gonna show you guys how to recover the software it's that simple okay so now I'm gonna just jump into my laptop to show you guys how this works um, I created a folder with stuff I want to delete right now I actually uh, you know I tried it already so you know I'm, I might get doubles but you're gonna get the, the general idea of how this software works and it works really well and it's really simple to use so here we go so this is my desktop here um, I have a folder here that I called to delete. So these are the items to delete. So let me show you the pictures that are in here. And it's just kids playing soccer, um, you know, running around. And then I have this video as well here. Um, it's a quick time movie video. So um, so I'm gonna delete these items and I'm just gonna take the whole folder. And um, hold on, let me just empty out the trash first. I'm gonna empty the trash. And I'm going to show you that the trash is empty. There it is. I'm going to take these uh, these items, and I'm just going to throw the whole the whole um, you know the whole shebang in the in the trash can here. And let's just go delete. And yes, empty trash. So there it is. So items are gone. Let's open the trash again. It's gone. Um, let's open the software. So here's the software and basically you have um, a couple of uh, uh, things that you could recover. You could recover photos, you could recover audio, you could recover video, you could recover emails. I haven't tried the emails yet but obviously uh, if the other stuff works the email probably works just as well. You could recover documents, um, PDFs, WordPress, Excel, etc. And then you have other or other data that you could recover you know maybe raw files or that sort of deal um, so why don't we just try to recover the photos that um, that I just deleted in the video so let, what don't we do we're just gonna click on photo we're gonna click on video here then we're gonna go to the next window and here in this window it gives you a couple of options of places to look for the things you have deleted now if you empty your trash and you do a search in your trash you're not gonna find anything because you emptied out your trash now the information is saved temporarily in the computer probably until you turn off the computer once you turn off the computer most likely the information is gone I mean again I haven't tried that out yet but I know that this part works let's just say I just deleted those files and I want to go try to recover them right now I could do that so I'm gonna go ahead and go into the, um, the hard drive here and we're just gonna start doing a search and it's gonna do a search for the files now mind you some of the files might be, uh, uh, you know, because I I did I did this already before I did it on camera. Some of the files might come up double, um, but you'll see the idea is of the files that I just deleted. They'll show up. Um, so let's just continue here, seeing the the scan and the scan is fairly quick. I mean, uh, it goes pretty fast. Now, mind you, I do have a SSD drive in my laptop, so that does help. Um, you know, the speed of an SSD drive compared to a regular. Um, you know IDE drive is, is you know night and day so um, I definitely recommend that if you could upgrade your hard drive in your computer do so because um, it's a big you know it makes a big difference especially if you're doing video so here we go so check this out so it recover the photos now it recovered them twice 
because I already deleted them once before, but here they are. So see the photos, they're double now. Um, so it's as simple as clicking on the photos that you want um, and just hit recover. Now, the software is gonna ask you to, that you should um, uh, save them somewhere else other than your hard drive. Uh, the reason is, is because um, the, the information that is saved is temporarily saving your hard drive and once you um, do a recovery and you save it to your desktop it sort of erases that ghost image wherever it is and you won't be able to get it again so that's very important so you should have an external maybe a, a USB drive or another hard drive handy so you could plug it in and use it for backup so again here it is and um, just go here we're going to the um, folder we're going to create a new folder, cover, and there it is on my desktop and just hit save and then the, you know, you're going to get this message, you know, to that different, you know, place to do it, but we're just going to do it there for now and it's just going to recover the files and if I go on here where it says quick scan, you just keep clicking, keep clicking, here are my files and zero lostness, um, the files are exactly how I had them before. They're 18 gig I'm sorry, 18 megabytes. Um, they're full, you know, in full, basically no lostness. The file is still there, just as good as it was before I deleted. The same thing with the video. Um, the video is right here, um, and I, I I have deleted this video quite a few times. So, but there it is. So, uh, the important thing is that the software works. If you're looking for an easy solution to recover your lost files, your lost photos, your lost audio, your lost, your lost Excel document. Um, Wondershare is what you need. Um, I don't know what else to say. I mean, you saw how it works. It's very simple. It works on a Mac, it works on a PC. You can recover items from hard drives, I believe iPods, um, some phones, some Android phones. I'm not sure about an iPhone. I haven't tried it on the iPhone, but you know my main concern was you know the files in my computer which I have deleted them in the past um, by mistake and as far as I know I, as long as you don't turn off your machine or restart your machine you'll be able to get the files back right away which is very important so basically three simple steps scan review recover that's it that's all that's all you need um, the software is available online I'm gonna give you guys a link for the software I'm not sure if I have a coupon code but if I do I'm gonna leave it on the bottom and it's $90 and it's a lifetime um, license so once you buy you own it is yours forever um, they do have like family plans where if you have five computers you could um, you know buy a license for five computers and I think that's like two hundred and something dollars but I definitely recommend if you're looking for you know peace of mind you want to make sure your files that you are working on uh, you know it happens to all of us you know you control delete in my case boom and it's deleted and, and next thing I know I forgot that it's in the garbage can and I press delete and it's gone um, so that's very important as always guys anytime I find a site that gives you money back when you buy stuff from them I, I gotta let you know because you know it's free money it's money you want to get back and of course these guys the guys that want to share um, you know they, they do give you money back and I believe is yes 15% back cash back so it's free money, you know, you, you're you gonna make the purchase anyways, might as well, you know, get the cash back. And I, I actually have the widget installed into my Mac. So anytime I um, I go to a site that offers, um, you know, free money, as I call it, I, you know, I know right then, I, all I gotta do is click activate. So um, something else before I forget, they are giving away free SSD drives um, for those of you who, who take their tests which is right here for those who take the test and it's basically they, they ask you a bunch of com you know computer questions and all that what have you and at the end you put your name and your email and you automatically enter and they actually send me one of the drives and um, I put it into my Big Mac and it's a great driver super quick um, SSD drives are the best things you know since uh, sliced bread I want to say yeah sliced bread right now <laughs> guys Thanks for watching. Um, if I have a coupon code for the for the software, I'm gonna leave it in the link in the bottom. I'm also gonna leave the link for Ebates. So make sure you guys get your 15% back cash back if you haven't signed up for Ebates yet. And that's it.
it works. Wondershare data recovery software works. It works on my Mac, um, it works on PC, and you can recover from virtually anything. Um, Macs, PC, Android phones, iPods, um, SD cards, you know. So basically, you can recover anything from anywhere with the software. Once you install it in your machine, all you gotta do is pop it into your USB drive, wherever you have, and then just hit recover the same way I, I show you guys how I did it. And as you can see, anybody could do it. This is, doesn't take a, you don't have to take your computer to a uh, Mac genius over there in the Mac store to get this done or take it to a, a repair guy for, you know, for him to try to get your information back on your hard drive. You could do it yourself. Um, save yourself some money, save yourself some time. Um, thank you for watching. You've been watching LG TV. I hope you guys found this um, uh, tutorial review informative. Um, please don't forget to leave a thumbs up if you think this video helped you out. Um, I am Juan Granos. Find me on Instagram, Los Granos, on Facebook, Los Granos, on Twitter, Los Granos. Thanks for watching, guys.